Oh, this is weird. Me doing audio. I haven't done that in a while. But, right, you reached out to me. You said you wanted feedback, so, you know, I might as well. And there's some, I, I see a few, like, small things you can improve on, but saying that in text form would be a little bit too complicated. So, I'm just going to try audio instead. So, I think there's, like, four things I wanted to point out. So, first thing is that's the sign. So, is it... Um, entirely clear what square activates until you came all or you come all the way over here and you see square is like for the exit so what you can do instead is like just get rid of the square sign and use the exit sign instead and just put the exit sign right here because if you're here you, it's kind of hard to see that square sign but if the, the exit sign was like right here say you know that button activates a, the exit that'd be a little bit more clear and then for this, you, you could just have like a, an X here, like remove the sign and just have an X there. You could do that by having this, um, having this indication on sign and then adding a bunch of, um, what's it called? Those um, light strips that are, oh my God, I can't remember what they're called, but they disable the, or they move the ant lines, just have those type of um, light strips and just stack them across everywhere until like the sign is gone you just have X or that you know you know what I mean so that is that uh, another thing is this portable surface so it's there for this part so you can get out easily or if you're if you launch from here right here and you add a portable spot and it's a little bit tight um, getting that there you know it's a little bit tight after the jump is a little bit tight here and uh, what you could do is just put this portable surface to right here and that will prevent a um, player from shooting a portal from here still because it still can't quite see that surface here right they have to be like all the way here which is you know, not going to happen so you could do that you know just move that portable surface there so it's a little bit easier and um, another thing so you have this this room which is appropriately sized and then you have this really long tunnel and what you can do to shorten this is to um well just shorten it is like take this room and move it into this wall right here and then you can take this wall and i don't know move it to like right here or something and if you still want the momentum you get from the space plates what you can do is have a one by one by one cube that's out here in the void and have the faith plates um, aim inside of that one by one by one square and then you could adjust the um, what's this called the arc that you get from the faith plate so that the middle of it goes right through this portable surface that would be like along here or something and if you still want this bullseye in that one by one by one um, cube you can make another faith plate and have that aim at that um, portable surface that you want so that way this entire tunnel is smaller you still have the momentum and you still have that bullseye um, I think there's a was that it I can't remember oh yeah and then this observation room right I used it unintentionally in my solution but you could also or another reason to get rid of it is that you can see how buggy the lighting is against the wall it isn't that big of a deal in this test because it's not very noticeable but ideally you want to remove the large observation room from your test and just have I don't know like the, the small observation room I think I think that's it really oh yeah and um, maybe have some lighting on this portable surface here because during my blind playthrough I didn't really notice it for maybe a couple minutes I could just be non-observant but um, because right, you can clearly see all these other portable surfaces. It's just, just that this is like right above your head, right it's fine where it's fine when you enter your test. And just not much of a reason to look up. So if there was a reason to look up, and you're right, you can't see it over here. I guess you, you have to go like all the way around like this, but do something like that. Oops. Like that to go all the way back around, and you have to. Be then you can just barely see it from here. So, I don't know, finding a way to make this more visible uh, could help you a bit.
And I think the just the easiest way to do that is with lighting. Yeah, I don't know. But I guess that's it really. That would do it for this video.